tonight, I'm going to tell you a little bit about what I do and what you can try doing too. Next time you're doing a restoration or you need some cables for your bike and you can't find the exact cable. Cables come, of course, when you buy them aftermarket. They're always nice and fresh with all the hardware replated. Sometimes you'll have a spring on something like this on a rear brake and you want it that way when you go to buy a new cable. Unfortunately, it doesn't always happen that way and you can't find cables for certain bikes and you wind up with old hardware like this. What you can do is you can cut that old hardware off right at the cable, take it off, remove it. You can polish it and have it replated the same way you do any other hardware for your bike, like your nuts, bolts, and fasteners. You can then get some cable just like this. You can get it from Motion Pro. They sell it in bulk. They've got the casing, they've got the cable, and you can then make yourself some new cables. They also sell a kit just like this. It's called a cable fittings kit. And it comes with a variety of things inside there, just like that, from barrels to caps to nipples to ball ends and all sorts of things that come inside that kit from Motion Pro. Now, there are other people that sell kits as well for cables. And in the future, we're going to do an episode on how to actually attach those cables again or, or the ends to those cables. But in the meantime, if you're looking to freshen up your cables and you can't find the right cable for your bike or you're out there on eBay or someplace else and you're looking and cables are... It can be several hundred dollars for cables at this point, and you're not seeing what you want, you can make your own cable. You can contact me if you want more information on this, but next time you need a cable, try that.